Hi everybody. Hey. It's Steve and Val. It's the Steve and Val show. And or we, the Val and Steve show. You look short. I am short. It's not short. I'm He's, hope to don't. I'm hope to don't. Do. It's because I'm leaning he, to the side. He's uh, taller than I am. There, how's that? Better. Alright, we have a tag. It's a Valentine's tag. And we want to thank Sandy over at Life with Sandy for putting the tag questions together. Um, we are doing tags once a month now. Um, I wish we would do them more often because I love doing the tags. Steve does too, don't you? Don't know what? Love doing the tags. What tags? He doesn't know. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to put him on the spot because Sandy has a Valentine's tag here. So, um, it's actually about 10 days or 9 days out from Valentine's. We're recording early because that's how we roll. So, um, here's the questions. Are you ready? Yeah. Alright, question number one. Would you rather get lots of Valentine's cards from lots of friends or from someone very special to you? Uh, from someone very special to me. Who is it? Who is it? Yeah, his mom. No. <laughs> no. I've never gotten a Valentine's from my mother. I think my mom sent Valentine's before. Yeah, I, I would rather just have one very special Valentine. Um, it, it can be more than one special Valentine from someone special. I would say sons and daughters and grandkids. Yeah. As well as my wife. Yeah, that would be good too. Alright, would you rather receive Valentines in an email or handwritten? No brainer. Handwritten probably. Means more, I guess. Yeah. I, I did that email one time and I'm, I, won't, I won't ever do it again. Wasn't a good idea. Bad idea. It's something you don't save. It's something that's very impersonal and like a last minute I forgot so I'm just going to send you an email kind of thing. And yeah, it's a bad idea guys. Don't do it. Yeah, not a good thing. Uh, definitely handwritten. And, and cards are nice but if you like write some stuff in the card, you know, maybe some thoughts or memories or something that even makes it more special. So... Number three, would you rather get a mushy card or a funny card? I don't know if they're talking about more sentimental than, I don't know, mushy. I don't really like mushy, but... If it's from my, someone very special, I, I'd take one each. How's that? Yeah, more like... Um, I've done that. I've done that for. I'll send a the mushy one and then I'll do the funny one too. Yeah. Kind of somewhere in between I guess. Just like uh, heartfelt maybe but not mushy. Not like... Like roses are red, violets are blue. I just farted. How about you? <laughs> uh, is, that, yeah. is, that, is that the kind of mush you're talking about? <laughs> yeah. That's, that's <laughs> that won't work. That, yeah. Okay. okay. Alright. Let's go with somewhere in, be <coughs> somewhere in between the mushy and the funny. Airball. Alright. <coughs> Number four. Would you rather get flowers or candy? Um, I think this question's for you, honey. These questions aren't for me. These questions are for you. No, you can do too. I give you Valentine cards. I've mm. given him some very nice valentine books i don't know if you're gonna give me if you're gonna give me flowers give me the kind that i can plant outside and i'll come back every year yeah i, I don't, don't need the candy yeah i don't i don't the flowers die so i i'd rather just have flowers outside i guess i don't mind getting flowers once in a while i don't need them for every holiday um, candy, I don't mind candy. I don't need an abundance of candy because I'll just end up eating it all. <clears throat> and that's not good. But, uh, I do like my candy and, and I don't mind flowers. 
uh, not, I don't want, you know, like two dozen roses or anything like that. They're, they're just going to die. But, you know, maybe a planted flower or something. That'd be all right. Um, I would rather get a weekend off with somebody, with Steve. Um, somebody. No, somebody. She said what she meant. She, she means somebody. From and that somebody, somebody very is not special. Me. Yeah, no, yeah. whatever. Um, so maybe like, and it doesn't even have to cost much. Maybe a, a day out at a park or something. Just doing something. Maybe a, a special plan or a, a special word or something. It means more to me. Um, I don't have to have the physical candy or flowers. All right, number five. What was yours? You said... I said flowers that will grow and come back every year outside. Yeah, that's true. All right, number five. Would you rather go on a Valentine's Day... Go to a Valentine's Day party with really good friends or a party with no food? Mm. What is it? Okay, food. Start over. Would you rather go to a Valentine's Day party, Valentine's Day party with really good food, or a party with no food but really great games and activities? I think I'd like the great games and activities. Yeah, that would be fun. Games and activities are always fun. <laughs> yeah, let's go with the games and activities. Question number six. Would you rather go on a go to a romantic restaurant or just have carry out at home? Uh, romantic restaurant. Yeah, that's nice. Carry out at home is good, but that's I don't know for for Valentine's Day day. I don't want to fight a crowd in a restaurant. If it was an if it was we had reservations and there wasn't it doesn't mean that we're going to do it honey it's just what would you rather i mean i'd rather do a romantic restaurant it doesn't mean we're going to actually do it a ram romantic restaurant on a cruise ship yeah that'd be okay we did that before we did valentine's on a cruise ship before that was very cool uh okay romantic restaurant we'll go with that would you rather host a Valentine's Day party or attend a party where you only know a few people? <laughs> Neither. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking about this one. I don't know that Valentine's Day is a party day. Neither. Yeah. My um, answer is neither. I don't think I'd... I'd uh, Valentine would be a party day for me. So, just a, a, a nice evening out and then time at home with somebody somebody <laughs> and i'm a nobody so we know that somebody's not nobody oh lord here goes negative steve <laughs> she started it i'm just going oh, with it oh no no he always puts words in the mouth all right anyway oh lordy um <clears throat> Number seven, would you rather create a uh, number eight? I'm sorry. He and I need for him to be reading. Would uh, you rather? I can't, I can't see it because of my headache. <laughs> oh, he, okay. Uh, would you rather create a homemade Valentine card or buy it in the store? I'd rather buy it in the store because I'm not that good at Valentine, Valentine's Day card making. Um... I don't mind the store-bought ones, and then you can write what you want in them or on them. I have got the Valentine books from the dollar store before, and just written on the pages and gave it to Steve. But he's got a couple of those, which on my shrine, in her on his shrine. Yeah, they're they're there on the shrine. So um, I think those are very cool. If you could find something like that, and then just put your own thoughts on each of the pages and stuff like that, it's very cool. Um, number nine, would you rather have chocolate covered strawberries or chocolate covered cherry candy cordials? Both. I don't know. You can cover anything in chocolate pretty much. <laughs> I, I like both because they're, they're both strawberries and cherries. I like both. But if I had to choose, I'd go with the cherries. I guess I like cherries more than strawberries.
I guess cherries too. I'm not sure. I'm going to say cherries, but I'm not really sure. All right. I should get one of each and put them in front of him and see which one he takes. Mm -hmm. All right. Don't do that. Final question. Question number 10. You can't buy just one of each. No, that's true. Would you rather eat only red foods on Valentine's Day or white foods? Hmm. <laughs> oh, that's not a good question. I don't know. <laughs> red or white? Um, How about red, white, and blue? Woohoo! Um, like red foods would maybe be pasta, maybe with red sauce or white sauce. Oh, I like the white sauce better. Because then you get the the Alfredo with the seafood and stuff. Um, white foods. Well, I'm a red meat, so I'm going to go with red foods. I'm a red meat kind of guy, so I'm going to go with the red foods. Uh, um, You're a chicken type of person, so you should probably go with the white foods. All right, I'll do the white. He can do the red. Everybody's included in our party. <laughs> We can't discriminate against one red or the white one. <laughs> well, just everybody's invited. All right. Um, so the bonus question. Valentine's Day. Overhyped or fun day to spread love? Oh, it's a fun day to spread love. Yeah, I think it's a fun day. Uh, even, you know, at work, if you give out a little... Uh, you know, candy on everybody's desk or no, something. I'm not, eh, not cool. doing that. I don't care for people that work that much. Uh, well, I, I do it just for fun. I do it sometimes just for fun. So, uh, we'll see what happens this year. But, um, those are the questions. Thank you, Sandy, for these wonderful questions. And uh, I, I hope you enjoyed our tag. So, if you want to do the tag, uh, let me know in the comment section below. And I will go check it out. And uh, if you liked any of the questions or have any feedback, put it in the comment section below. If you all leave a comment, I'll remember to go and check out your videos. So don't forget to leave me a comment. And then what? Give the video a thumbs, thumbs up. Thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Right. And uh, we'll catch you all on the next video. And spread the love. Happy Valentine's Happy Day. Happy Valentine's Day.